Good evening and welcome to today's national news. Doctors are warning people to be on the lookout after the recent viral outbreak which has seen thousands of people rush to London hospitals within the last week. Early today, Dr Thomas Wilson, head of a Hammersmith hospital, issued a statement in which he suggests that the disease was brought to the UK through an unknown carrier who was showing the early signs of a virus, the simple flu. He states that the virus is first believed to be a strand of necrotizing fasciitis, also known as a flesh-eating virus. The virus is bacterial and attacks soft tissue, usually in the extremities, following minor trauma. It can also occur after surgery. However, many of the people in hospital have received no form of surgery within the last six months. Wilson states, therefore, that this could be a new strand of necrotizing fasciitis or brand new disease entirely. Psychiatrists have linked the outbreak to nihilistic delusional disorder, also known as Contrad syndrome. Many patients are suffering from depression and suicidal tendencies, and a small number have also claimed that they can smell their own rotting flesh and feel worms crawling in their skin. Reports from across the country have claimed that a number of people taken to hospitals have lost the ability to speak. Doctors believe that this, combined with the psychological systems and flesh-eating virus, sounds likely to be a form of the Solium virus, the last known outbreak of which was in America in 2002 in the Virgin Islands. Doctors are warning people that this disease can spread when an infected person infects a healthy person through bodily fluids, mainly sexual intercourse and biting. Doctors are also warning that this disease is highly infectious and dangerous. In order to avoid infection, they advise people to contact their local services if they believe they are suffering from symptoms or if they see anybody acting strangely. As of yet, there is no cure, but doctors, both abroad and in Britain, are working together to find one. If people believe they are being infected, they should co contact their local hospital as soon as possible. For more information, please ring our local hotline or visit your local GP. Doctors across the country, however, are urging people to remain calm. In other news tonight, Gordon Brown... I'm sorry, we've just had an image in of an alleged victim. All right.